Hi, I'm Janice. I am a Coast Guard veteran. I currently serve as military and veteran affairs here at Battleship Iowa. I served back in 2010 and uh, down in San Diego on a Coast Guard cutter, the largest one at the time actually. Um, so it was a high endurance cutter and we had about 175 man crew. And even though I was in San Diego, they sent us up to Alaska. So we were in sub-zero temps up there and it was a uh, beautiful, wild, incredible, uh, you know, time. Veterans West, Military and Veteran Affairs at Battleship Iowa. Um, our mission is to provide impactful veteran services, resources, and um, what's really important is that they are vetted, um, that they, you know, provide quality. Um, what's really, really important here at Veterans West at Battleship Iowa is that quality resources need to align with who we are. It has to have a cultural alignment and that's really important for us to find the right fit. This is a place where you're going to be able to come hang out. You're a veteran, you're mil actually this is serving not just veterans, it's, mil it's veterans, military and their families, um, also known as MILFAM community. So what's really cool is we're gonna be welcoming veterans to come in. Let's say you need to tap into internet. You wanna come and hang out. You wanna to talk to other vets. You wanna get down and um, you know receive services. We're gonna have all that above. Um, we have a lot of ceremonies, events, uh, different activities. Uh, we're planning fantail fitness and different you know programs and things that are gonna be enriching veterans' lives. It's just gonna be a really impactful place where we're gonna have uh, just amazing amazing people that we're bringing to the table with great personalities and um, and those that understand the unique needs of this community. We are all veterans, um, all military, no matter what your service era, what um, discharge that you have. So we serve all veterans in all military community. Um, you know, despite anything. So there's no barriers of being able to receive services with us. And that's for every branch of service as well, even the Coast Guard. So number one, we are four years ahead of schedule. Um, so we are absolutely um, looking great. And the idea of, you know, naming is so important and we wanna have a name association, Veterans West, we are the West Coast hub of military and veteran services. That is a national effort right there. Um, we are in uh, discussions with partners all over the nation currently. Los Angeles is the largest veteran population in the entire nation. Um, and in LA, a lot of experimental processes and initiatives happen. So we are going to be that place that gets to decide and, and, and forward that motion. Battleship Iowa is gonna be the forefront of making those things happen. That change is gonna happen because of Battleship Iowa's um, uh, effort. This is a dream. Literally, it's a dream come true. And I'm like, so excited. <laughs> I can't even tell you. Uh, my exit out of the Coast Guard was extremely difficult, extremely difficult. And I, I moved up from San Diego, not quite sure where I was gonna go, but um, Los Angeles community is the largest population of veterans in the entire country. So I expected to receive um, an abundance of assistance. And although assistance is available, it's really hard to navigate those services. And um, I didn't really have anybody to walk me through that or help me to understand uh, where to go. I had to search, search, and search. I'm under a lot of stress and, uh, you know, the VA can only go so far. And so, um, that was, gosh, 2013, um, until today, you know, it's been, it's been a fight. It's been a huge, huge fight. And I see a light at the end of the tunnel. We are bringing something that is just absolutely life-changing to veterans here. And um, you're gonna see some very purposeful, some very thoughtful, and uh, things that are just truly gonna be making a difference. We're not just saying it, we're doing it.